All right, back we are with Even the Ocean. I really like how this game has really nice, you know, character interactions and characters in general, but it doesn't really... Uh-oh. That's fine. Hold on. Okay, there we go. I'm trying to full screen window this thing, and it it kind of works, but it kind of doesn't. Um, I wish all developers loved full screen window as much as I do. It's really just kind of the best. But uh, sometimes it doesn't work right depending on, I guess, what engine and how things are set up. Huh? Oh, I guess we're at story already. <laughs> I like his little smirk in his um, in his lower res uh, image down there. Yeah, it's me. Right on. I've got a message for you. Paxton said to tell you he just went. Uh, oh no, they went early. Paxton woke up early and decided to go on ahead to Oscar Basin to scout things out. Yeah, he's dead. Mm, that's not good. Okay, well, thanks for delivering the message. Certainly. Oh, wait, wait. You're Alf, Alf, right? I don't really see this guy saying oi, but whatever. Uh, yes? I have a message for you. Like, oi! Blimey! We got a message for you! Oh, Paxton said to tell you she had a family emergency! But she'll be making off with your Oscar Basin as soon as she can! I'm sorry, Monty Python is all I know of British accents. The best British accents. What? Are you serious? Damn it, this is not good. What's the matter? We we're all supposed to go together. Yeah, <laughs> I, I should have known that the whole together thing was not happening at all, ever. <laughs> Whatevs. Let's go save these idiots. Well, with this one idiot, I guess just Paxton. Oh, I... Hello? What are you doing here on the world map? Whoop, there it is. I left a pot on the fire and I'm just running out to find some rosemary. In situations like these, I always shift my balance towards purple energy so I can run faster. This purple necklace I wear is an ancient accessory designed for purple aligning oneself for travel. Pluck, pluck. Take care. Okay. Yeah, the, the, the beginning doesn't really, like... I don't know, it doesn't beat you over the head with- <gasps> Airships! Hell yeah! Wait, is that airship or horrible monster? Both are- okay. This pile of stones look deliberately stacked, and their trails traces of purple dye. That's interesting. Oh, there's a little search button. That's interesting. Oh man, I- I know I said this before, but- but- but I miss world maps! Give me some world maps! I, I want world maps. I don't even care if they're lower, you know, fidelity than the rest of the game. It's fine. It's a world map. It doesn't, you know, it's supposed to be a little bit abstracted. Eh, whatever. Let's go to Oscar Basin. Oh, look at the snow. Am I ready to start the mission? I, how are you not noticing the giant monster or airship? Yeah, there, there, there we go. I don't think you need binoculars to see that. Oh. The Gona. Okay, so we, she's, she's just okay with this. She's just totally fine with this. The Gonome, the Geome looms in the distance. I better check in now. White Forge, this is coming. This is Aleph. Mm -hmm. Hey, Aleph, how's it sizzling? Please don't address me like that. Uh, well, I think I made it here before the Geome's full on assault. But overall, things are not looking good. Paxton went in early by himself, and Lopez had some family emergency to attend to. I just managed to ask her based alone. Did you know about this? Mm -hmm. mm, nope. It's like I said, Aleph. These folks are not quite so dependable. But I'm confident you can handle things. Remember, all you need to do is get to the central control room and punch in some manual override commands when the geome is close enough to be damaged. Piece of cake. Okay, Mr. Mayor. I like that sunset. And them clouds. I like the pixel art in general in this game. Really nice. It's kind of that... I guess you don't see it too much anymore. But uh, it's something that's really like um, Quest for Glory 4. It's kind of this detailed... It, it looks like a photo or a painting, but low res, but not in a bad way. It looks... It's just this interesting mix of detail, but still pixel. And it works really well, in my opinion. And you don't see much... Modern pixel art doesn't really go for that style too often. I mean, there's a lot of different styles you can go for pixel art, so... You know, that's okay, but uh, I still like seeing some of this. 
Is that someone at the gate? Oh! Hey, wait! Can you open that gate back up? I need to get through. What was that for? Jerk holes. I've already found the jerk holes in this situation. I mean, this is a freaking giant monster! You got better things to do than, you know, playing hide-and-go-seek with your freaking gates. Some people. This probably feels really squishy and gross to jump on. But it's also probably really awesome to jump on. These look flying like oyster thingies. Which might make me hungry if I didn't think oysters were gross. But they're pretty gross. I, don't know, I have this thing with, like, uh, I guess I should open these. Well, I guess I don't really need to go back, but still. What's this? This fountain is frozen. I wonder if it's supposed to be that way. I can't imagine it ever unfreezes. Welcome to Oscar Basin. This wintry s this Is that how you spell that? Wintry? The city is based on one of the world's largest, greatest natural sites. The bowl of trees! Delicious. Yeah, I'll have a bowl of trees, uh, deluxe, and uh, a small beach. Thanks. To go. So named for the unique trees growing horizontally. Ugh. Uh, oh, I just noticed. Wow. Visit and enjoy some of the year-round holiday cheer. I just, this is the tree. Wow. That is actually pretty cool. Should I take this elevator? Yes. Hmm, frame rate's being weird. I think I just need to play this windowed. I don't know why it doesn't... Uh-oh. I think I just made things work worse for myself. Hold on, I'll be right back. Aw, oh, yes! Love that tuba. Aw, oh, yes. Aw, oh, yeah, shred it! Aw, oh, it's my jam! Oh, head! It's the mayor, except he's black now. It's the mayor's black cousin, just like Professor Oak's black cousin. <laughs> oh, hey, Dolly. Hey, good one, Dolly. You got us good. Hey, wh wh why is there a ninja here? Why are you a ninja, ma'am? Hey. <laughs> there's, just, there's just a ninja here, and nobody's like, nobody cares. Well, you must be Aleph. Hope you enjoyed our welcome song, despite the interruption. I'm Chairman Darnell Vale. On behalf of the citizens of Oscar Basin said So is every mayor required to be, like, the same guy? Is that how this works? It's like, you're assigned your position based on your physical appearance, not, like, qualifications. That seems like a very video game thing to happen. The Oscar Basin Satellite, and I welcome you to our humble township. We are simply tickled pink that you've chosen the Oscar Basin's very own power plant as the next site of your valuable maintenance engineering. Uh, yeah, thanks. I'm certain you'll find Oscar Basin to be a pleasant and fulfilling place to work. I know we certainly do. <laughs> As you've seen, we are currently under attack by a huge monster. This shouldn't be a problem for an old pro like you, though. Everyone is so calm. Why is everyone so calm? It is It is kind of okay to be freaked out. There is a giant freaking monster that wants to eat everybody. Oh, whatever. The old mayor tells us you're his top agent. Heh <laughs> I'll do what I can. I need to make it to the core and ruin some diagnostics and fixes. And I should be able to drive off the creature by redirecting some station's exhaust vents. Certainly. Let me know if you have anything you can cheerfully do to help. The power plant entrance is located in the Boston Oscar Basin, and there's a lift that leads directly inside. The lift activation should be in lift keyhole. We don't worry too much about hooligans here in Oscar Basin. Yeah, the, the ninja stole it. I already know. I, I already freaking know. Having a bit of fun is all well and good, but she always interrupts right before my solo. Well, you know, teenagers, she's part of that, what's it called, emo trend? <laughs> it was on a TV special last night. Oh, ninjas are emos, everything makes sense. That sounds like some sort of, like, supernatural high school, like, anime or video game pitch. The ninjas are emos, the punks are berserkers. Um, the preppy kids are the paladins, the, uh, the nerdy kids are the clerics. Did you enjoy my rhythm? You have a flute. Do you really do- is flute- uh, flute's not like a rhythm thing. 
Is it? I don't know music. I don't like. I don't like flutes. Flutes ruins Sticker Brush Symphony. In did I just go out of tune for a second there? Um, yeah, flutes ruined Sticker Brush Symphony in Tropical Freeze. I'll never forgive them for that. Plus, it was one of those instruments that like everyone tried to learn. No, no, that was recorders. They won. They gave everybody recorders. Those things are awful. Welcome, visitor. My name is Costanz. <gasps> it's George. Jerry. I'm afraid we don't have much information about the power plant, Jerry. My husband, Darren Mitchell, Jerry. He's the one to talk about that, Jerry. Oh yeah, I forgot to say, be sure to smile. It's good for you. Sorry, I'm a bit distracted, Jerry. We, we, we gotta go, we gotta go get some soup, Jerry. Wait, no, is that, that's more, that's kind of more Kramer. Woo. I think the aliens just downloaded my brain. Oh, uh, hi. How's Oscar Basin, my friend? Uh, it's fine, and, uh, yeah. I like her. Oh. <laughs> Purple stream of horrific death. Okay. Nice town, though, aside from the purple stream of horrific death. It kind of reminds me of a Final Fantasy town. You know, we live on the, you know, horizontal trees. There's a gigantic vortex of death. Uh, don't pay that too much mind. It's fine. Uh, only about 5% of our population every year dies to it. It's not really a big deal. Oh, goodness. You're looking a bit beleaguered. I have just the thing. Apply this cream around your eyes. It's all the rage in White Forge City these days. That'll fix you right up. And remember, your smile is your best feature. Let me see it. Don't you dare ask me to smile. I will kill your family. Uh, smiles. <laughs> That's me. That is me. Um, smiles. <laughs> And then you're just not actually smiling. How could any man resist? Oh, goodness. <laughs> These two. This looks like the OU dog. He's like, OU. Oh, He's like, <laughs> Wow. What's up? Hey, 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 Hank. You come to the game later? You got it, Carl. Wouldn't miss your wife's bean dip. Ho, oh, ho, No way, Hank. There's an indefinite memorandum on you and bean dip. I never Witness such a magnitude of gas as the one time you downed the old seven layer dis dips catastrophe. Oop. Downloaded the brain hole again. I actually really like that, but it's so weird. It, it like. It really w messes with the mood, though. But at the same time, it's really cool. Uh, that's saying something. Coming from a resident of Oscar Basin. <laughs> Oh, hey there, something we can do for you, young lady. I'm gonna just be several miles away from you two. Oscar Basin? Oscar Basin, great views, great people. What can I say? We get our kicks, so, oh, oh. Well, we sure get our kicks a lot more often than Riverton races. <laughs> oh, God, I wanna die. You watch you say about my team, Carl. As if the Oscar Basin elves are ranked much better. I'll say what I want, Hank. Aw, oh, gang fight! Ah. Oh. All right, let's just let's just leave background characters from King of the Hill alone. What's up with you? There's no use in being sad. That's what I always say. If someone is sad, it's because they're not making the best of things. I think you're an idiot. It's so annoying when people just mope around instead of, you know, making things better for the world. It's like we all have a choice, you know? Like, wow. I'm so enlightened. Everyone's problem is that they're not me. Wow. Like, if some boy doesn't like you, just move on, right? It's so annoying when people get ruled by their emotions. Like, wow. I don't like her. Oh, bubble! Can I go into the death stream with the bubble? No, I can't. Like, is that just an ambient sound that just, like... Threatens to kill everybody, and like if you're outside when that sound plays, everyone's head explodes. Seems like the sort of town that would have that. Warning, dangerous gas below. Oh, Hank! Make sure the lift has been sealed before entering the power plant. <laughs> okay. Oh, it's a book! There's a book on the ground. The cover says Dolores' Diary. Yeah, I just leave my book, my diary, you know, at the cliff face, right next to the horrible death gas. This is a very safe place. Dolores' diary, keep out. Oh, that's even safer. Okay, let's get down to business. This isn't actually a diary, but I knew you'd try to read it. You got me, Dolores. 
You got me good. I know how much y'all love psychoanalyzing me and my bad temper. But honestly, maybe just try psychoanalyzing yourself for a change. Why'd y'all get so boring? The culture of the city is so fascinating to y'all. Why don't you just move there? Trying to make our bases some pale facsimile was a huge mistake. I don't think people who say y'all know what fac facsimile means. Y'all think I'm just away because I'm a teenager. Maybe so, maybe not. Anyway, why should that invalidate anything I say? Why can't you hear the longing in your voice when y'all say this is the best years of my life? Aw, oh, if anyone tells you, if you're a teenager and somebody tells you that, that, that you're ha experiencing the best years of your life, please punch them in the face. I mean, don't like go to jail, but they, they you know, they deserve that punch in the face. They're idiots and they're lying. That just means they never made anything of themselves and, you know, that usually means, that's usually a parent trying to live vicariously through their kids. Don't, don't fall for that crap. It's, ugh. There's some nice things about being, you know, a kid. Enjoy, enjoy it while you got it, but, uh, there's a lot of things that suck. And I mean, yeah. How do I operate this? Oh. Let's see, it says turn key to activate lift, but I don't see the key. Oh no, the emo stole it! I better go get him and see if he knows what's going on. It was obviously the ninja. The lift key seems to be missing. Do you know anything about that? Hmm, can't imagine why anyone would take the key. I'll search my office for a spare. In the meantime, you can ask around about it. I'm sure there's a simple explanation for this. <laughs> okay, thanks. <coughs> of course, Halif. If you need anything else, you know where to find me. He just freaking disappeared! Why is everyone ninjas? I'm the only person who is not ninjas. It's stupid. Oh, wow. I'm so much better than everyone. Oh, wow. Hey, hey, Hank, you coming over for the game? You got it, Gar. Look at their faces! Oh, you. Oh, you! You just know these guys make out when nobody's watching. I wouldn't wish your wife's bean dip. Oh yeah, kiss me. Kiss me like you kiss my wife's bean dip. Oh. No way, Hank. There's an indefinite... M oh, it's the exact same dialogue. Oh, come on. I don't, I don't care. Lift key. Oh, why did I have to listen to that just to ask for lift key? Regular old pickpocket, that one. Oh, don't look at me. Carl still hasn't returned my grill tongs. <laughs> oh, uh, okay, thanks. <laughs> Aleph is just literally me. It's pretty great. Where's the lift key, you frickin'... No, you you just... you. How much cream do you have? And why do you just keep applying it to my face? I, this makes me really uncomfortable. I'm gonna file... I'm gonna file a complaint about this. I'm pretty sure that's illegal. Have you seen an emo ninja? The lift key? It's gone missing? I don't know anything about that. Are you sure? It's really important that I get through the station. The creature might attack the settlement next. Uh, do you promise you won't get in trouble? Was it Dolly? I'm not here to get in her trouble. I just need to get into the power plant for everyone's safety. Understand? Uh, yeah, of course. Well, Dolores just took the key and hit it. I don't know why. It's in the frozen fountain. Aw, oh, damn it. Thank you so much. Oh, she's not mad. Are you good friends? Yeah, we're, uh, yes, good friends. I'm sure she'll understand. This is really important. Doop, doop, doop. Alright. So you might have missed a teeny bit of the start of that. Yes. Um. It started playing also immediately once it clicked into the window. For some reason, while being recorded, this game just has performance issues. Oh, this is the freaking ninja. That's freaking creepy. Oh, wait, no, this is like a memory se segment, isn't it? Watch this memory? Yes. Why are there memories now? There weren't memories before. <gasps> Many years ago. You ever wonder why the fountain's flowing water even while all around us is ice and snow? Mm, no. Haha, <laughs> but it's fascinating, right? Okay. <laughs> That's kids. That's kids for you. This water doesn't freeze because it's always in motion, always cycling. If it sat still, it would freeze solid. It's just like us people. We need to keep moving, learning, and trying new things so we don't get stuck, frozen. Okay. <laughs> also, the water's heated, but hey, we all need a little help now with it. Yeah, years later, I'm pretty sure moving water can still freeze. Look, Trace, the mountain pump broke. Must be recent. The water's still wet. 
Oh gosh, we should tell someone. It could break really bad if water freezes on the inside. Hmm, don't think anyone really cares to be honest. Oh, you freaking emo. How dare you? You can tell she's emo because she has one of those ring things in the nose. The nose hole. That's what they look like. That's what they look like. I'm not biased. I'm not biased. You're biased. Now, it looks like it hasn't been maintained in months. Don't throw the key in there. What was that? Key to the power plant lift. And now did a while back. It'll be a little present for anyone who bothers fixing this fountain. I guess it'll be frozen there for a long, long time. What a dick! You suck! Is that... It's the lift key. <laughs> That's hardcore. Just bash open a hole in there. This confirmation thing is interesting. It doesn't seem like the sort of game that really needs that, because I, I can't really see this game making me, like, forcing me to make any, like, permanent decisions, but it could be really useful for that, like, do you want to delete your save file? Yes, no. And, you know, right at the end of, like, something where you, you know, mash 50 dialog boxes and it asks you something, like, super important, like, that'd be pretty useful. Hey, what are you doing? Why are you trying to stop me? Y'all the ones trying to stop the Great Whale. Great Whale's the best thing that's happened to this place in a long time. It's gonna kill us! I mean, just look at it. It looks like freaking Sin from Final Fantasy X. We're all dead. What do you mean? It's destroying the plant. Yeah, the plant, aka the worst thing that's happened to this place in a long time. Do you not like freaking light bulbs? I've never met anybody who didn't like light bulbs. Not aside from commies, of course. All it ever does is now and watches their boring TV shows and suck up to the mayor and the city folk. Everyone's obsessed with this idea of being happy all the time. But the, what they really want is just never have to feel bad about anything ever. Nobody cares about true feelings. Well, I, uh, sorry things have been that way for you. But the Great Whale doesn't care about feelings either, honey. And it's my job to protect this plant and these people. Maybe you're right. Maybe not. But if that's your job, then this is mine. Oh. Oh, you gone done it, honey. Oh. Oh, you gone and done it. Now the glass of shatter is not safe to go through this shaft. I'll need to find some kind of protection. Oh, that's what that thing was. Okay. Well, that's convenient. Boop. But, but how do I get back up? Oh, well. Okay, looks like I'm gonna take the lift down the power plant. All right, fitting our uh, little thing. I guess we're gonna call it quits here. Right around 15 minutes. That's perfect timing, and we'll uh, explore this next time.